Hi, welcome to another unboxing video with Melissa. Today we are unboxing my very first arcade block. Um, I was interested in getting an arcade block this month because they said there would be a South Park Stick of Truth item in it, and that is my favorite game at the moment, so I'm hoping for a nice item. So let's see what's inside. I haven't been spoiled on anything, so first thing, got a t-shirt. This looks cute. Oh, I like this actually. I really like this one. So it's a video game t-shirt and it's got different creatures on it. So we've got some kind of octopus versus some kind of fireball. They kind of look like Pokemon. Oh, I, I recognize this one, but I don't know who did these. Might be Pokemon. It says creature select. If it was the normal Pokemon, I think I'd recognize them, but I don't recognize any of these off the top of my head. I think this guy, this is supposed to be a cactus, I think. And I'm not sure about the other ones. There's an octopus guy here, don't recognize him. He looks like an alien. And the other ones, I don't know. But I like the shirt. Those are video game stuff, so do you have any other information? Um, exclusive nerd block. You have acquired amazing t-shirt. Oh, I like this a lot. It's cool. You have acquired amazing t-shirt. All the strength and stuff you get from it. Shirt only found inside arcade block. Apparently it retails for $19.99. Awesome. So, good start so far. Much better than this month's um, nerd block. I have a hat. Oh, it's quite a nice hat. So it says on it, you can see, Fox Hound. I'm Special Forces. I'm not sure what the reference to that is other than Star Fox, maybe. Kind of looks like Star Fox, but also doesn't really. So, got a hat. Well, it looks pretty good as well. I'm going away soon, so I might need a hat for the sun. So this is actually quite a nice hat. I won't leave it on now. Actually, maybe I will. I think it's quite cute. Leave it on for the rest of the video. We'll see. Um, we've got... Um, oh, it's a magnet. Okay. Kick punch. I have no idea what that's a reference to. It's got also uh, a little microphone. If you know what this is a reference to, let me know. Oh, I think I get it. Okay. So you got the two buttons on there, and they are from a video game controller. So I'm guessing one means kick and the other one means punch. I'm not sure what the frog means though, or the microphone, but kind of get it. Not really. <laughs> Let's see. I'm trying not to. Small box as well. So we've got. <laughs> oh, this is good. Me and my partner really like Mario Kart. So it's a little warning sign for your car that says blue shell on board. And I have to do this reference because I love Ashen's videos. It's zero to three sad onions. So no zero to three year olds can have this. The sad onions say so. <laughs> but yeah, so blue on, uh, blue shell on board hanging car sign. Unfortunately I do not own a car, but I'll put this in the window. I still think it's awesome. I don't think I can attach it to my bike. <laughs> what does say? What else do we have? I've got a little card. I don't want to look at that. Yet. So I see the South Park item. I'll leave that for last. So I've got a mysterious miniature box. Oh, what's in this? Oh, some kind of glass. Oh, I think I like this a lot. Okay, this is. Oh, it's a jar actually. Well, that's cool. So it's a little jar, and it's got health hearts on it, and one of them's about half done. I guess this is for storage. That's quite cool. I've never seen anything like this, so that's neat. So far, I'm liking everything in this uh, arcade block. And the last item, well, we've got our little card explaining. This is going to be a mystery, so I'm not going to look at it. Pocket tray jar. Um says it could, this jar could hold my favorite health restoring or mana potions that have been proven in lab condition to be effective means of transporting sprites. K 
kick punch wood magnet follow the mine if you have a memo I'm sure you'll find this wooden magnet be sure to hold to your refrigerator where you can show it so I've got this is what was inside the box oh and I like this this is enough and as you guessed it's a South Park figure I haven't looked to who I got yet oh oh so I'm not gonna look yet I'm not gonna look at so this is who I could get I was actually really hoping for an actual stick of truth. I know it sounds ridiculous, but I would actually like a stick, <laughs> just a stick. There's a stick of truth on it, and that would have been cool. So I got the warrior, who I, oh, this is why I always have problems. It's either Stan, I think it's Stan, I'm pretty sure it's Stan. Oh, I really wanted Princess Kenny. I'm going to have to be on the lookout for Princess Kenny. I think this is Stan. Oops. I think I've just broken Stan within a second of him being in here. Yep, I've just broken him. I oh, know that goes back in. That's fine. So there is little Stan. In his warrior costume. And his cape is actually, like, attached to him, but not molded to him, which is kind of cool. And his head turns, so he's got some articulation. His arms raise a bit. That is really quite cool. So we've got Stick of Truth figures. So there's five to collect in all. So we've got Butters, Cartman, Kenny Stan. Oh, I'm blanking on the other name. I can't think what the other name is. Oh, I really can't think. I don't know why. I should know this. Oh. I'm sure you'll tell me in the comments because I can't remember what his name is. Kyle. Kyle, of course. Kyle. Duh. Okay. So, I think I've got Stan. Could also be Kyle. But I think this is Stan. I'm pretty sure. But, yeah. So, he's quite cool. Sadly enough, Stan is my least favorite character other than um, Jimmy to play in the game. So... Not the best one. I would have preferred Princess Kenny, Cartman, or Butters, but you get what you get. And I can look out for the Princess Kenny one to get at another point. So that's been my arcade block. Let's just see what the box looks like in the end. That is interesting in a nerd block. But yeah, so we've got a little bit of circuit board in here. And of course, it always looks like a Nintendo box. Old SES. So, not bad. I think I might continue that for another month. I like the hat. I like the little jar thing. I think I'll probably put jewelry in here. Quite nice. I love the South Park figure. And the t shirt was awesome. So, yeah, this has been really good. Oh, and I forgot the car sign. Also awesome. So, lots of good stuff. The only thing not so great about is the wooden magnet that I really just don't get. I understand they're probably standing for kick and punch the buttons, but so what? I don't really understand what the little frog in the microphone is about, but fine, it'll do. But all the rest, quite good. So thanks for watching. Um, I'll be having another video soon about stuff to do with my book. So talk to you soon, bye.